Don't forget, we can have a lot of fun with this. So we can choose another location. Let's exit out Netflix. Let's give the VPN a second to come online. Now let's go ahead, let's enter it. And let's see if it thinks we're in Hong Kong. So it's gonna take a second for it to load. You can see down here. And there we go, guys, look at that. Number three in Hong Kong today. So now we're in Hong Kong. Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to install a VPN on your home Wi-Fi router. Thank you to ExpressVPN for sponsoring today's video. If you're in the market for a VPN, I would highly recommend ExpressVPN. The link will be in my video description below. I'm also gonna to link to some other popular routers that work with ExpressVPN that you can download and install their firmware on, and then you can have your whole network protected. So you might be wondering, why would you wanna install a VPN on your router? Well, I'm so glad you asked. So it's for a couple of different reasons. The biggest one for me is convenience. I no longer have to sign in on each individual device. Now I can just do it one time and we're all set and ready to go. And once we put on the router, then literally any device connected, like your smart TV or any other smart tech you might have around your house is gonna be protected as well. And you can say goodbye to device limitations as well too. Say maybe the paid plan that you're in only has two devices, five devices, 10 devices, whatever. Now, once you do it right to the router, you don't have to worry about that anymore. Everything is covered. So that's why you would want to do it. Today's video, we're gonna be using this Linksys Wi-Fi router. It's the WRT 3200 ACM, but I'll link to some other routers below for you guys. Now let's go ahead, let's get everything set up. First up, I wanted to give you guys a quick overview of the whole process. ExpressVPN has excellent help and tutorial articles on their website, walking through the whole process that we'll be doing here in the video. But first, we're gonna download their ExpressVPN firmware, power on our router, install the firmware, connect your router to the internet, and set up ExpressVPN on our router. So you can see step-by-step, step, everything we're gonna walk through today is online for you. Very simple and easy to do, anybody can do it. But there you go, guys, that's it. Basically download firmware, and then get it installed on our router and then sign in with our Express VPN credentials. So now let's go ahead, let's proceed to step one and download the firmware. So once you sign up for Express VPN, you'll be at this setup page. If you're not, just select the setup button right here in the top right hand corner. We can now view our activation code and we can see a wide variety and range of devices that we can download Express VPN for. In this case, let's select router. We have three different setup options right here. Let's select the first one, install on the router I've been using. Now we need to enter our make and model. So in this case, we're using the Linksys WRT 3200 ACM. And there we go, it just downloaded the firmware for us. So we can go to the next step. And here we go, it has eight more steps for us, letting us know what we need to do to properly set everything up. So we have eight steps clearly outline for us to be able to get everything set up. So you can see when our Linksys dashboard now, we're ready to go to our router settings, select connectivity, and now we're gonna have to select manual, right here, router firmware update. So stay on the first tab, the basic tab, and in this case, select manual. So we're gonna choose a file, and now it's gonna load, and we're gonna find the file that we downloaded so here we go, select open, and now we can choose start to get it installed. So here we go, we selected start, we need to choose yes, this is a warning though in case, you know, something malicious is going on, which isn't the case here. Select yes to continue, we get one more option, yes again, now it's installing the firmware. So there we go. The firmware has successfully been installed. Now we need to reboot our router. So go ahead and select OK. Now we wait while the router reboots. Once everything reboots, you'll be at this screen where we're ready to select Get Started. So let's go ahead, let's select Get Started. It's gonna detect our internet connection right here. Could take a couple of minutes. Here we go, it loaded very quickly for us. Now we need to add our activation code right here. So go ahead, find it from that page we previously looked at 
in the setup section on ExpressVPN's website, paste your activation code here and select sign in to ExpressVPN. We successfully signed in. This is the next screen you'll be at where we can choose to help improve ExpressVPN. You can choose okay or no thanks. Then you can view your Wi-Fi name and password right here. We're gonna leave it the same right here. No issues at all to change any of that, but we could personalize it if we want. Let's select continue. Now we need to set a router admin password. So go ahead, type a password and then select continue. Here we go, this is the next screen you'll be at. You can see we're all set. We have a review of our Wi-Fi information and our router admin information. Now we can go ahead and select save. And there we go, everything has successfully been set up and you can see we're connected to our VPN right now. We can view our VPN settings right here and we can also select devices and you can see what we have going on. So let's go back to VPN and now we can choose some options. We have some recommended options right here. So you can see some quick selections or we can view all locations by regions. So really quickly, let's just browse them all so you guys can see tons of different options right here. Next up, the Americas. Europe. And then we have the Middle East and Africa. So you can see the different options we have right here. Let's go ahead, let's go to recommended. And just for fun, let's choose the UK. And you can see it's working on connecting it. There we go. So now we're connected in the UK. It's that simple guys to set everything up and now we're running ExpressVPN on our Linksys Wi-Fi router. So just to make sure everything was working properly, I went over to Netflix on my computer and sure enough, it thinks we're in the UK now. So we have access to the UK Netflix catalog. Don't forget, we can have a lot of fun with this so we can choose another location. Let's exit out of Netflix. Let's give the VPN a second to come online. Now let's go ahead, let's enter it and let's see if it thinks we're in Hong Kong. So it's gonna take a second for it to load. You can see down here. And there we go, guys, look at that. Number three in Hong Kong today. So now we're in Hong Kong and we can view and watch Netflix with the same thing. We can get access to those region locked TV shows and movies in the Netflix specific catalog for the Hong Kong region. Well, there we go, guys. As you can see, setup was simple and straightforward. Everything works great. I didn't have any issues at all. Thanks to ExpressVPN's helpful documentation online, anybody can do this. Just make sure you have a compatible router. I would say expect maybe five or 10 minutes at the most to complete this setup. It is totally worth it. So now you don't have to sign in on any of your other devices or worry about device limits with your plan. It's all done right through the router and you're all set and ready to go. Well, that concludes our video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget the product link will be in our video description below. Please go ahead, check it out and do your shopping from there. Any purchase made through that link helps support our channel at no additional cost to you. So we're really grateful and thankful for all of your support. While you're at it, can you go ahead and hit that like button for us? and subscribe to our channel. We have new content coming out daily and we don't want you to miss anything. Please go ahead and give us a follow online and make it a clean sweep. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Discord. You can message us on WeChat, check out our website and join our free newsletter. Thank you guys so much for being here. Don't forget new content daily and we can't wait to see you in our next video.